Hello, this is Joe Masato coming to you for the Oklahoman live from the Staples Center after the Thunder's 112 to 107 loss to the Los Angeles Lakers on Tuesday night. It was the second night of a back-to-back -back for OKC after losing 90 to 88 to the Clippers on Monday night. Um, and it showed a little bit, I thought, in this fourth quarter. It was another game where OKC was, you know, kept it really close down to the wire. Contavious Caldwell-Pope hit what I thought was the dagger three late in the game that changed things for the Thunder. And it was just sort of a strange night for the Thunder offensively. Um, four of their five starters really struggled from the field. Shea Gilgis, Alexander, Chris Paul, Stephen Adams, and Terrence Ferguson. None of them really got going. Instead, they had to rely on Dennis Schroeder and his 31 points off the bench to provide a spark offensively. But that wasn't enough to keep up with the, the megastar, superstar, however you want to call it, duo for the Lakers. LeBron James and Anthony Davis. LeBron James had a triple-double. The Thunder was the only team in the NBA he hadn't recorded a triple-double against, so made history tonight at Staples Center. Russell Westbrook probably won't be too far behind. The Thunder is the only organization he hasn't recorded a triple-double against, so that will probably come perhaps later this season. But LeBron James finished 10-21 from the floor, 25 points, um, 10 assists, 11 rebounds. Anthony Davis was even better. 13 of 24, made three of five threes, finished with a game-high 34 points. And, you know, it's, it's just kind of what you would expect coming into this Lakers game where so much of the volume of shooting centered around LeBron James and Anthony Davis. And the Thunder didn't really have a, a, an answer, most certainly for Anthony Davis, they kind of found an answer for LeBron James, and it was a surprising one in the fourth quarter. Deontay Burton checked in with about nine minutes left. He played six minutes in that fourth quarter. While Burton was on the floor, LeBron was one of five from the floor. He did not make a shot when, when Burton was guarding him. So if you're looking for an encouraging sign for the Thunder um, after they dropped to five and nine, it's that Deontay Burton showed some flashes of potentially being a wing defender that the Thunder sorely need after losing a guy like Paul George uh, and, and Jeremy Grant in the offseason. So encouraging sign there. But again, the Thunder lose on the road, second end of a back-to-back. -back. And now OKC is 0-6 away from Chesapeake Energy Arena, 5-9 and um, on the season. The Thunder will be back in action Friday night at home in Oklahoma City against the same Los Angeles Lakers. We will see how they fare then.